Previously, we made a video explaining Noster, an open protocol that enables decentralized censorship resistant social media. So if you are new to the topic, definitely check that out first. Now from our experience, using this brand new protocol can feel daunting and alien at first, as admittedly, it may not have the best UX at the moment. That said, if you're feeling up to being an early adopter of a potentially game changing protocol, here are some tips and best practices on how to safely start on Noster, particularly around managing your private keys and privacy. To start using Noster, you will first need your own Noster key pair. While it can be done by simply clicking on the sign up button on various Noster clients, such as Iris or Primal, it would be safer to generate a key pair through a dedicated key manager. Not to mention that without a key manager, the only way to log into Noster apps is by manually entering your private key on Noster clients. As these function in the same way as a crypto wallet's private keys, it should be stored securely and exposed as little as possible. Therefore, it doesn't make much sense to copy paste your private key onto a web page every time you're logging into a Noster client. A dedicated key manager or signing extension like Nostux and Albi enables you to manage private keys in a secure manner and safely sign actions whenever you're interacting with Noster clients. Albi's browser extension in particular also comes with a self-custodial lightning wallet, which can come in handy when sending and receiving tips on Noster in the form of Bitcoin sats. If you feel like exploring other signing extensions instead, you can head to nosterapps.com, click on signers on the sidebar for alternatives. To start out on your computer, we'll be using Nos2x in our example today, as it's minimalistic and doesn't require you to provide your email. Nos2x is the original signing extension built by Noster founder, Fiat. It is available for Chromium browsers such as Chrome and Brave, but a forked version of NOS2X is also available on Firefox. You can find its fork listed on addons.mozilla.org as NOS2X-Fox by Diego. After adding NOS2X to your browser, open up the extension and click on Start here to begin setting up your key pair. This will look different on the Firefox add-on. Simply click on Options page to proceed. In the new page that popped up, click on generate to create your brand new key pair and then hit save. You should see a message under the save button confirming that your newly generated private has been saved on NOS2X. Again, this is slightly different for Firefox users. On the options page, you will first have to click on new under the profile section to create a new profile, then click on generate under the keys section to create a new private key and hit save key. You should see a green prompt confirming that you've saved the private key. Just like your wallet seed phrases, you should create a backup and store it somewhere secure. However, private keys are too long and error prone to write down on paper. So we recommend that you use a password manager to store it safely. If you're not already using one, you can consider using Bitwarden, which is free to use. For Android users, you can use Noster just as you would on a desktop by using Firefox. Firefox on Android supports extensions, and this includes Albi and Nostux Fox. This allows you to securely log in on Noster apps and have more control when signing authorizations on your mobile device. If you prefer not to use browsers, you can also try Amethyst, which is a Twitter-like Noster client available on Google Play. You can enter your NSEC private key to log into Amethyst, which should be remembered and stored locally on your device and not shared anywhere else. However, do not make it a habit to copy paste your private key frequently on many different apps, as this will greatly increase the risk of leaking your private key. If you'd prefer to use a separate signer, you can use Amber to sign into Amethyst. Amber is a key management and signing app for Android. However, the app is not on Google Play and you would need to download it through third-party sources like Fdroid. As for iOS users, the social app with the best UX is Damus. Log in by entering your private key directly into the app or create a new account. Similar to Amethyst, if you remain on the same device, this would only be required once, but just remember to save your login info when prompted. Unfortunately, 
Unfortunately, there seems to be no simple solution for using a separate signer for iOS. Firefox extensions won't work on iOS due to incompatibility and the solutions on Safari that we have tried had a very clunky experience in order to set up and use. However, if you're a power user and you would like to test it out for yourself on Safari, you can try web-based signer nsec.app or the Safari signing extension, no store. Now that we've got key management out of the way, it's also worth mentioning that relays on Noster link your Noster activity with your IP address when you're connecting and interacting with Noster. So we suggest using a VPN when using Noster if you want to prevent Noster relays and apps from tracing your IP address. After setting up, you can head to nosterapps.com for a curated directory of nearly 100 different apps at the time of shooting. If you followed along so far, you may have noticed the UX experience can feel pretty clunky at times with stuff taking a long time to load relative to your regular Web2 apps. And besides that, being a much newer protocol means that there's a smaller user base and less content. For now, it seems much of the community are Bitcoiners. And if we're honest with ourselves, most of us won't be leaving Twitter just yet. Growing pains aside, Noster is playing an important part in decentralizing the internet. And now more than ever, we need some pushback against the worrying trend of growing internet censorship by governments and corporations across the globe. So if traditional social media were to turn into complete shambles, we still have Noster. So remember, if you're starting out, use a signing extension app like Nos2x or Albi, store your keys in a password manager, and preferably use a VPN to protect your privacy. If this video helped you out, leave us a like and subscribe for more Web3 stuff in the future. Bye.